Hello, my Bible viewers. Welcome and thank you so much for always considering tuning into your most favorite online TV channel. This is definitely Public Design Media TV and I'm your Julius. For the very first time today, I'm traveling to Rusinga Island. I'm going to capture a story behind the story. Uh, you can see I'm on my favorite motor transport, which is the motorbike. I really like using a motorbike. I'm heading to Kisumu, whereby I'm going to board the Matatu. For a public transport, which is going to take me to a place called Rwanda Kotiyan. So, if it's your first time to watch my channel, please be sure that this is the only channel that you need to watch each and every time. You want to enjoy exact, accurate, specific, and relevant content that is meant to make you a better person in whatever you do. My valuable viewers, this is a place called Rwanda Kotiyan. It's a very famous place known for fish production, and you can see from the lenses that everybody here is trying to vend a fish and it's a very productive place for people who are doing fish uh, what you call the fish vendors uh, today is my first time to be here i can see the water bus is here ready to ferry us to the other side i'm going to rusinga island so i want you my valuable viewers to watch out for hot and upcoming content which will be coming in my channel anytime from now and thank you so much for keeping it right here. Make sure that you subscribe to this awesome channel, Public Desire Media TV. If you haven't uh, subscribed to this channel, please do so. Kindly share all my videos, like, and everything that I do in this channel is going to promote you to try to do more in everything that you do. So welcome, if it is your first time to be on this channel, feel at home and stay tuned for more upcoming content in my channel. So as you can see, the water bus is just waiting for passengers it will be leaving at 1 pm according to the residents here they have just informed me that uh, that uh, it, it waits for two hours it's now 11 and they're waiting for 1 pm to leave this place so let us wait and then yeah we we'll watch hot hot content in my channel My valuable viewers, it is 12.15, we are just about to leave this particular place. I am being informed by the residents of this particular place that we will be leaving at exactly 1 p.m. So if you intend to come to this place called Luanda Kotiano, please make sure that you come using a public transport from Kisumu and make it your way up to Luanda Kotiano. It's around a two hours drive from Kisumu and you are going to have a nice hospitable, hospitable place. Uh, at place called Luanda Kotiano. There are very friendly places here. You can come here and have food. You can have here a place to spend the night also if it is late for you. And also you can get direct transport going back to Kisumu. So my valuable viewers, I encourage everybody who intends to be at this particular place to make a point to come here so that you can also have a nice time and enjoy himself during these uh, holidays. First thing first, to eat first, get the energy to carry you for the whole day. So my valuable viewers, I'm enjoying a delicious meal here. Um, you cannot come to this particular place and live without enjoying this delicious. So um, yeah, let me enjoy my meal before I carry on with the day. You can come here and also have the same meal and enjoy. You can actually 
you can actually witness the level at which I've enjoyed this meal. Uh, guys, I've just taken a good lunch now. It is time to board the water bus. In about 10 or 30 minutes, we'll be leaving. So I want you to continue watching this particular channel. Enjoy the video until the tail end. The water bus is somewhere here, not very far from where I am. It's 30 minutes, 10 minutes to go, then we'll be leaving. This is something which I did not expect to see. It is quite unhygienic to to see somebody cleaning vegetables at the waterfront. But I think this is a way of life here which they have adapted. And this is how things are being done over here. It was quite surprising to see this kind of thing over here. But uh, nevertheless, it is what it is. So I decided to take this short video of this lady doing this so that I can also be careful <laughs> with the water I eat when I come into this particular place. So anytime you visit this particular place, you will have the opportunity to enjoy fresh, fresh fish. And you can see people from all walk, kind of walks, they are coming here to enjoy life here. We have visitors coming every day, every day to this particular place. As to why I was saying this is something which I did not expect. You see, when you come to this particular place, you expect to see some kind of uh, activities uh, which uh, are welcoming. But a visitor coming to this particular place just to see a lady doing this kind of activity, and another one is washing clothes on this other side. This is something which really, really demoralizes somebody to to visit this particular place so i urge anybody who can control this kind of thing can come and also tell the people here that look there are people who are coming here they are watching what you are seeing what you are doing and it's not very very healthy so my valuable viewers in another 20 minutes will be leaving with this water bus the water bus is here waiting for passengers and then when you cross to that far end that is the Rusinga Island. I don't know how long it is going to take, but it is expected that around two hours we'll be crossing over to Rusinga Island. So if you like this video up to this moment, please don't forget to give it a like. Don't forget to share it as many times as you can with your friends. And also, most importantly, I'd like to see your comments in the comment section. Thank you. So first thing first, when you come here, you pay first. It's around uh, 150 shillings, Kenya shillings. Then you board the water bus. So I'm planning to pay over here at this particular point so that my journey can continue to my destination. I hope you do enjoy this particular video to this moment. Please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Share it with all your contacts in the contact section. And yes, support the channel by subscribing if you haven't subscribed. We are now inside the water bus. We have just left uh, Luanda Cotieno and we are heading to Mbita. I have been made to understand by the locals here that after reaching Bita, we'll take a, a motorbike also to Rusinga, where I'm going to do a content regarding one Thomas Joseph Mboya. Uh, this was a prominent uh, Kenyan politician who was assassinated long time ago. So since it is my first time, I entirely depended on locals to get direction, also to get guidance on how to reach to that particular place. So I want you to continue enjoying this particular content.
right from the beginning until the tail end. If you do like this bomb content at this moment, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to share it as many times as you can with all your contents. So I'm inside the water bus and I'm enjoying the ride of a lifetime. We have reached the bitter point and now we are planning to alight from the water bus and uh, this is uh, the other side of the island where I'm going to do content. Now everybody is here trying to get his luck in terms of uh, doing business. You can see from the look of this particular channel, from mm -hmm. this particular clip that uh, there are also um, fishmongers, so, motorbike riders, and uh, small, small business yeah, traders are here. So it's all about wow, struggle. Everybody so, is to earn his from uh, motorbike and, shilling, to, to and the most important thing is to put food really on the table. So I'm here with the motorbike rider. I'm trying to so shape the, the bus fare, him. the transport fare, yeah, sorry, that so that I can also board one to take me to where okay. I'm going. After a short discussion with the motorbike rider, we come to an agreement on uh, the amount which I'm supposed to pay. Now we have started our journey to where I'm going. So kindly watch this and enjoy the journey to our destination today. So first things first, uh, he has just told me that we have to fuel fast because it's a long distance. So we are going to alight a short place whereby we are going to put fuel to add fuel then we continue with our journey wow this is the most famous bridge the most famous bridge if you come to this particular point bitter point you have to make sure that you pass on this bridge so this is the only way people can know that you are on this particular point i hope you do enjoy this clip up to this moment please don't forget to give it a thumbs up
finally finally we have reached uh, Tomboya Museum we have reached the destination where we are going so I'm so pleased that I finally found my way and uh, I'm successful let me put it that way I'm successful that I found my way and I'm going to do content here so I want you my valuable viewers to watch for part two of this particular video the first part was to show you how I've traveled to this place the second part the most and very very important part which I want you to continue watching this particular channel don't miss the second part of this particular video stay blessed have a nice time watch out for the next video I was so glad that I finally reached the destination. I decided to take a light walk just to see how the place looks like, just to have a feel that finally, yes, I've done it to my destination. I'm so much pleased. So watch out for part two of this video.